Step number one to making sure that you gain over 15,000 followers every single day on TikTok is making sure that you're adding a call to action to every single video that you're creating. Seriously, every single video. I see so many creators every single day, probably hundreds of creators every single day that have gotten a ton of views on TikTok and I'm sure this has happened to you. You have videos that get a decent amount of views but you're just not getting the followers from it and the reason being is because you're not adding a call to action to every single video that you're creating. I see so many creators on a daily basis that do not have at least 100 followers for every thousand likes that they have and it makes me want to smash my head into this desk. The reason that you guys are not getting the followers that you want to gain on TikTok right now is because there's no call to action. You need to give people a clear reason to follow you. If you do not give them a clear reason to click the plus sign or to follow you, and for those of you that don't know, when you get people to click the plus sign on TikTok, you cannot see it on your own account. You can only see it on accounts that you are not following. It gets people to then follow you. It's a non-intrusive way for you to ask people to follow you in exchange for something. Let me share you an example. Etsy Kish is a creator in my mentorship program that has gained over 695,000 followers. And one of the biggest things that he's done differently in the last couple weeks alone and he's gained over 50,000 followers in just the last week is he's making sure that he's adding a call to action to every single video. Now he's doing something very simple. In the last three seconds of the video, he's just putting on the screen, click plus. Now I would not recommend that you guys do this and I actually think he would have gained way more followers if he made it more specific to the video that he's actually creating. For example, if you made a piece of fitness content and you made the piece of content of how to increase your squat, you should be ending that video with click the plus sign if you wanna squat 225 or click the plus sign if you wanna squat 315 or something that's aspirational. Or if you're creating nutrition content, you should get them to click the plus sign for something. For example, click the plus sign if you wanna find out how to make healthy Snickers. Click the plus sign if you wanna learn more healthy recipes that you can make in less than 10 seconds. Whatever the topic of the video was, you need to make sure that the call to action that you have at the end of the video is then getting them to obtain the thing that they want. This is one of those examples where you have to sell somebody the thing that they want and then give them what they actually need. Let me explain that. Somebody that's watching your beauty videos, somebody that's watching your fitness videos, somebody that's watching your videos about real estate, they don't actually want to see more content from you. They want the thing that you are selling them. They want the thing that you're promising to provide them. And that is what you should have the call to action actually be focused on. Step number two to starting to gain way more followers on TikTok is making sure that you're actually putting out enough content. And this is one of the biggest reasons that so many of you guys are failing to grow on TikTok. You guys are approaching social media, you're approaching TikTok like it's something totally new, like it's a casino basically. At the end of the day, if you wanna blow up on social media, be it Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, doesn't matter what it is, you have to put out enough content. If you're under 100,000 followers, you need to be posting at least three to four times a day. Now I'm gonna share with you later in this video how you can do that in literally 10 to 15 minutes of time. I'm sure you have 10 to 15 minutes of time, right? Yes. You do. So let's get that out of the way. If you have the aspiration of blowing up on TikTok, you need to at least be putting out three to four pieces of content a day if you're under 100,000 followers. Now, if you're over 100,000 followers, I would strongly suggest you reassess and go back to whether or not you should be putting out quantity or you should be putting out quality. Because so many of you creators that are under 100,000 followers, you guys are putting out one video, two videos, 10 videos, and then you're in the comment section saying, Rob, TikTok sucks, how come I didn't go viral? TikTok sucks and you didn't go viral because this isn't a casino. It's the same thing as sports. You wouldn't shoot 10 baskets and expect to make the NBA or expect to be in the NBA finals. So why do you expect to go viral on social media when you barely put in any effort? So as a rule of thumb, if you're under 100,000 followers, be posting three to four times a day. And then once you start to gain some momentum, go to five to six times a day. After you pass 100,000 followers, we're going to have to reassess that. If you want my opinion, leave a comment below. I'll tell you what I would do on your account. Because for some niches, it makes sense for you to slow down to one or two posts a day. Some niches, it makes sense for you to slow down to one or two posts a week. And some of you guys should keep posting as much as you possibly can. For example, this creator in my mentorship program gained over 700,000 followers and she continues to put out several pieces of content. Now, not every piece of content goes viral, which is another huge mistake that you guys are making because you need to realize each post on TikTok is judged individually. That's why you see creators with 100,000 followers that have a video with 3,000 views and 300,000 views next to each other. It doesn't mean that they made a mistake in one video. The amount of views that you get on TikTok is simply predicated on the size of the audience that TikTok has for that content and whether or not you actually serve that audience's need. I'm gonna be explaining more about this later on in the video, but just make sure that you guys are putting out enough quality content. Like I was saying, this creator right here gained over 700,000 followers in the mentorship program, puts out several pieces of content every single day and it works for her. Why does it work for her? Because she does a good morning post, she does a good night post, and then she posts whatever she wants to during the day and this allows her to put out a ton of content. Now remember, I'm not saying that you need to spend three to four hours a day brainstorming TikTok content or even filming TikTok content. If it's taking you more than 15 to 20 minutes every single day to put out TikTok content, you're doing something terribly wrong. Because the truth is, if you're watching this video right now, you're probably spending your time on TikTok doing the wrong things, which is exactly why you're not seeing the success that other people are seeing and you're not seeing the results that you wanna see. 
That being said, I don't have time to cover everything that you're doing wrong in this video, so please go to the pinned comment below, get my free TikTok growth course. It covers a ton of things that I'm not gonna have time to cover in this video, like what hashtags you should be using, what time you should be posting, and so much more. In addition to that, make sure you smash that subscribe button because you are never gonna wanna miss another video that I put out on YouTube. I put out five videos a week about how to grow on Instagram, how to grow on TikTok, and you cannot afford to miss them if you wanna grow. In addition to that, I answer every single comment that I get on my YouTube videos, so please leave a comment below. DM me on Instagram, I also answer every single DM I get on Instagram, and shoot me a text message right here, I respond to every single text message that I get. Now, like I alluded to earlier, step number three is you guys need to be putting out the right topic of content. Again, this is exactly why you can see a creator with a million followers have a video with three million views and 300,000 views or 3,000 views right next to each other. It's because TikTok is 100% predicated on whether or not there's an actual audience for your content. What you guys need to realize, so many of you guys are putting out videos for an audience. You need to realize that TikTok knows the audience that they have. They're trying to find videos that then work for that audience. You guys are thinking about this totally backwards. And this is exactly why before you post again on TikTok, you need to make sure that you're doing research on whether or not the topic even has a chance to get a lot of views or get you a lot of followers. So many creators are putting out videos about topics that TikTok is just not going to push. They're not going to push it because they don't think they have an audience for the content. You guys, please, before you post your next TikTok, type in whatever the subject of the TikTok is into the search bar. Go to the top right-hand corner, filter for this month, filter for most liked, and if those top videos don't have over 100,000 likes, I would strongly reconsider the topic that you're about to post about because there's absolutely no no chance that you go viral and there's absolutely no chance that you gain over 15,000 followers a day or even a thousand followers a day if the topics you're posting about don't have a chance to go viral. In addition to using those videos to determine whether or not your topic even has a chance to go viral, you need to make sure that you're also paying close attention to the hook that they used, how long their video is, and the sound that they're using in their videos. TikTok takes all three of those things into consideration when they're gonna determine whether or not to push out your piece of content and you need to make sure that your videos are around the same length, they're using the same sound, and you need an even better hook than what that creator used. Because at the end of the day, if you're creating a video about the same topic that somebody else made a video about, you need to beat them out. And the way that you're gonna beat them out is by using step number four, which is hitting the right metrics on your TikTok content. Now, when it comes to the percentage of people that are actually completing your TikTok video, you need to be aiming for 65% of people. Now, this is really hard. So if you get 45 to 50%, that's really good, but you guys need to be striving for 65% of all people completing your videos in addition to that. When it comes to the watch time that you're getting, on videos over 41 seconds long, you need to be aiming for 40% watch time. On videos 31 to 40 seconds long, you need to be aiming for at least 50 to 60%. For anything, 21 to 30 seconds long, you gotta be aiming for 70% watch time. And for videos from 13, to 20 seconds long, you should be getting 90% for any video under 13 seconds long. You need to make sure that you're getting at least 100% watch time. If you guys are not hitting those metrics on those videos, they're just not going to take off. You're not going to get a lot of views. You're not going to get the followers that you want and ultimately that you deserve. And please, for the love of God, stop making your videos the wrong length for your content. Again, look at those topics that went viral on TikTok within your niche. You need to make your videos the same length. If their videos that are going viral in your niche are 30, 33, 35 seconds long, how long do you think your video should be? It should be from 30 to 35 seconds long. The videos in your niche are five to 11 seconds long. How long do you think your video should be? They should be five to 11 seconds long. Stop trying to recreate the wheel. You guys can model your content after people that have already been successful before on TikTok and you're going to see massive results. The opportunity to grow on TikTok and this organic reach is not going to last forever. And the only thing separating you from the creators that I mentioned in this video is one, that you haven't implemented the steps from this video yet. And two, you haven't gotten into my mentorship program where I literally guarantee that I can help you grow on TikTok. If you register for this program, I'm gonna tell you exactly what to post, when to post, what hashtags to use, and I'm gonna critique your content for 30 days in order to guarantee that you grow on TikTok. You heard that right. If you don't grow on TikTok in this program, you get your money back, zero questions asked. The average person that has joined the program in the last 30 days gained over 50,000 followers and the lowest amount of followers anybody has ever gained in the program is 6,500 followers. If you want results like that, and I'm guessing that since you're still watching this video, you're probably above average, so you probably see more than 50,000 followers in just 30 days, no matter what niche you're in, no matter what background you're from, none of that stuff matters. The only thing that matters is you need a social media coach. You need somebody telling you what to post, when to post, what hashtags to use so that you get results faster and you get results a lot easier. If that sounds interesting, go to the link in the description below. There are limited spots available and the price is gonna be going up in 2022, so please make sure you check this out. This is the same exact program that Devon used to gain over 20 million followers, that Joel Magician used to gain over 16 million followers, that Avmoves used to gain over 14 million followers, that Tuvok used to gain over 10 million followers, and thousands of other creators. I'm telling you guys, this opportunity is not going to last forever. If you wanna take advantage of TikTok, you need to invest in this before the price goes up, before there are no spots available, so that you can guarantee that you grow on TikTok. At the end of the day, you have absolutely nothing to lose. You're either going to grow on TikTok or you are gonna get your money back, zero questions asked. Go to the link in the description and sign up right now before spots run out. And by the way,
Anyway, if you're not interested in that, just check out the two videos I'm gonna put up on the screen because they're the videos that YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thank you so much for watching.